It provides more options for the customer, helps the bar, helps get people in the door, just all together seems like a good idea. Could alcohol to go be making a comeback? Alcohol to go became a really popular option for many New Yorkers during the pandemic, and it was a life preserver for bars and restaurants struggling to stay afloat. That's why Governor Hochul is hoping to reinstate the regulation as part of the 2023 budget. News 10 NBC's Brett Vetter joins us now with reaction to the possibility of the measure becoming part of state law. Brett? Yeah, add alcohol to go to the many layers of the 2023 budget that lay in limbo right now as lawmakers scramble to pass something well beyond the April 1st deadline. For patrons like Dennis Glavis at Temple Bar in Rochester, alcohol to go doesn't seem like a bad idea. I think it would help, you know, people that can't get to a store uh, to buy some beer or whatever, or help the economy of the bar. So I think it's not a bad idea. The emergency regulation, which lapsed in June of 2021, that allowed New Yorkers to order alcohol to go is one that could be brought back for a temporary three-year period if the budget is passed. Something that Temple Bar patron Kyle Johnson says makes sense. If people, even if, you know, it's not necessarily they want to just don't want to come in, maybe just want to swing through, grab some food, grab some drinks. Um, either way, it'll make the bars more money, it'll help them stay open, help them provide more for their consumers, and all together, I think it's a great idea. According to the budget measure, while sales by the bottle would still be prohibited, to-go drinks would still need to be purchased along with, quote, a substantial food item. Safety precautions that Glavis says makes sense if you're going to make alcohol to-go an option for customers. You know, people in the neighborhood can come get beer, you know, or a drink and take it home to go. I mean, as long as you're not driving, you know, like we Ubered here. So, you know, you could take some beers if you don't have any at home and take them with you. All bars and restaurants with licenses for on-site consumption would be eligible to sell to-go alcoholic beverages. However, local laws governing open containers would remain in place. Now, I reached out to the owner of the Temple Bar and Grill for comment on the proposed measure, and he declined to comment. And as we enter the Easter holiday weekend, it's unclear when a final budget measure will be passed. All right. Thanks so much, Brett.